I know most of the Heartland fans couldn't even get to watch season 17 since it was only on CBC Gem. But here we are, talking about the next season. Don't worry though, in this video, I'll share my knowledge about how you can watch season 17 too. Still, I should say that I'll mainly focus on the future of this show and the release date. First things first, I think season 17 was pretty good. Honestly, I wasn't expecting such a great season after learning Amy would get another love interest. If you watched my previous Heartland videos, you most certainly know I'm obsessed with Nathan, and he's my favorite among all the men we saw Amy with. Except for Ty, of course. I thought Nathan would be just like the others, and I thought I would get bored. However, I genuinely enjoyed his character's addition to the story. I think the dynamic and chemistry between Amy and Nathan is worth watching. He's perfect for our talented girl Amy. And it seems like Lindy likes Nathan too. After all, she was the one who invited him to cloud gazing together. I also enjoyed watching Katie and her efforts to discover herself. It was really inspiring for me to watch, and I believe she became an incredible character in this season. Probably the only storyline I didn't enjoy is Luz. She was such a drama queen in season 17, and at some point she even let Jessica down which was pretty bad to be honest. I just can't process how she left her alone with all the things she had to deal with in the gallery. But overall, I think this season was beautiful, and it made my Sundays better. As you may know, if you're from the United States, you can watch weekly episodes of Heartland Season 16 on Up Faith and Family. Monthly plan is $5.99 while the yearly plan is $53.99. I think it's a pretty good deal, and moreover, it's probably the safest option out there. Since the season 17 finale is released, Up Faith and Family might get its rights to stream it on their platform in the following months. Another option is to use VPN, obviously. As you know, CBC Gem is free, so if you could find a safe VPN, you can watch the show for free. But I highly suggest you do a good research on the VPN you're planning to use. Now, let's talk about the future of this show. Season 17 finale didn't feel like a final, if you know what I mean. We need another season to learn what will happen to Amy and Nathan. Also, the business is going down and they need to conclude that storyline as well. Plus, I checked Heartland's Instagram page as well as the CBC blog dedicated to the show. And all I can say is that they referred to the last episode as season finale, which means they're planning to shoot another season. CBC didn't announce whether the show is renewed for another season or not, but I just know we'll get what we want. The ratings seem pretty good so far, and people are obsessed with the show. Heartland has the potential of telling different storylines, like, we could see Lindy as a teenager and the show may focus on her in the future. I think it would be lovely. I honestly would watch a spin-off that focuses on Lindy, don't you think it would be great to see her as a young adult? As for the release date, I think we may get to watch season 18 in fall of 2024, and the trailer would hit the internet a month before the actual release. Considering the pre-production, filming and post-production process, I think less than a year would be enough to finish a season since the show doesn't heavily rely on special effects. But of course that's just my prediction. I'll keep you updated as soon as I find a clue about it. But for now, unfortunately, we don't have much info about it. Do you think Heartland should be renewed for season 18? Should they end the show with another season or not? Let's discuss in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe and check my other Heartland videos. Thanks for watching, see you soon.